אוקיי, קוהלייום, יהאווה, בהשם יהאושע, בהשם וכל הקודש. מי נאמר זה למדיה. אני רוצה לתת דבר אונס לאלדס אפסל גרי מילסטון. And Shalom to the hopeful elect. So the premise of this video is going to be on acknowledgement because that's a, that's what the Most High want from us is acknowledgement, and that's what separate the elect of Israel with the two thirds. And we also. carry the same traits that the most high have the same way men want to receive acknowledgement or the same way the most high want to receive acknowledgement we also want to receive that acknowledgement in our everyday lives whether it's from your wife or your kids you want that acknowledgement you know because A man being the head of the house he he makes a lot of sacrifices to bring in resources to the home and the last thing that man want is to not feel um valued so what I have on the screen I'm gonna start with reading the definition for acknowledge. Now, give me one second. So this is from Oxford Dictionary. And the first definition reads, accept or admit the existence or truth of. Now the second definition is, recognize the fact or importance, importance of quality thereof. So that's, that's, that's what it means to acknowledge or receive acknowledgement. What if you had a family and you, that and you wasn't being acknowledged you you putting food in the fridge or you making sure there's always food in the fridge the light the light bill is always paid the gas bill always paid and someone You're, you're the you're the ones that live in the home treat you like as if you know the resources don't come from hard work you'll be angry well that's how the most I feel about us now the first scripture I want to read is the book of Isaiah I'm gonna start at uh, chapter 1 verse 2. Now it says, Hear, O heavens, and give ear, O earth, for the Lord has spoken. I have nourished and brought up children, and they have rebelled against me. Now the, that the, now the children that the Lord has nourished and brought up is the nation of Israel, and they have rebelled against the Most High. Now the word rebel means to fight against Israel. And who they fighting against the most high now they do this when they speak up against the word of the most high or they speak against the prophets the teachers of the Lord that the most high has sent and that's how they rebel because the most high has nourished Israel and nourish me to to provide for he gave them resources and When they, when they needed rain for their crop, the Most High, He gave them rain. He gave them safety. He gave them all the essential things that was needed for one to live. But they rebelled against the Most High. Now it says, The ox know of his owner, and the ass his master crib. But Israel do not know. My people do not consider. Because Israel, These are both cattle, but they understand where the resource is coming from. Who's providing for them? But Israel don't know. These cattle acknowledge their master, whereas Israel do not. 
Now it says a sinful nation, a people laden with iniquity, a seed of evildoers, children that are corruptors that have forsaken the Lord. They have provoked the Holy One of Israel to anger. They have gone away backwards. So instead of pursuing the Most High, they go against the Most High. Now it says, Why should ye be stricken any more? Ye will revolt more and more. The whole head is sick. The whole heart is faint. Now let's go to Hosea. Five and fifteen. I will go and return to my place. Now who's speaking? This is the most high. And it says, until they acknowledge their offense. The day is who? Israel. So the most high was gonna turn away, turn his back on Israel, because they have turned it back on him. They went away from the most high. And it says, And seek my face. Now, how is the face of the most high? Most high sort through these words through the prophets, right? And it says, In their affliction, they will seek me early. So, the Most High was angry with Israel, and it said, In the affliction, they will seek me early because whenever things got bad, that's when Israel went to call on the Most High. But when things was going well. The most high was away from their thoughts. The same, this, the same way is going to happen again. Right now, the teachers is out there teaching about the about your how about shim how Our people want to hear it, but when the most most high start bringing judgment down on this earth, that's when they're going to try to get right, and that's when they're going to want to acknowledge the most high, and they're going to want to acknowledge their offenses. Now let's go to Jeremiah chapter 4 and 22. For my people is foolish, they have not known me. They are saddest children, they have none understanding. They are wise to do evil, but to do good. Now the word good means godly, but to do good, they have no knowledge. So the Lord, he, he have called his people saddest, which means stupid. Because once you go away from the Most High, that's a poor choice. Now, they could talk about, they have knowledge on everything and wickedness, but when it comes to righteous, righteousness, they don't have it. At times, our people are worse than Esau. Give me one second. I go to Isaiah. Um, five and one on down. Now it says, "Now, now will I sing to my beloved a song of my beloved touching his vineyard. My well beloved have a vineyard and a very fruitful hill, and he fenced it and gathered out the stones thereof and planted it with the choices vine. Now this vineyard." symbolize Israel and the church's vine is the the um going into Abraham Isaac and Jacob the forefathers and it says and built a tower in the midst of it and also made a wine press therein and he looked that it should bring forth grapes and it brought forth wild grapes now these wild grapes is referencing to like poison berries so the most side set of grapes but rather than grapes you got these poisonous berries now it says and now O inhabitant or inhabitants of jerusalem and men of judah judge i pray you betwixt me and my vineyard what could i what could have been done more to my vineyard that i have not done in it so the most side saying well i did everything right you know, I nourished it, I watered it, and it says, Wherefore, when I look, there should bring forth grapes, 
brought it for a wild grape to the most i like what the hell is this this don't this this don't look like what i planted oh this is not what i planted this is something else You know, the most I looking like I planted grapes. But Israel, but Israel became something else. Now it says, and now go to, I will tell you what I will do to my vineyard. I will take away the hedge thereof, and it should be eaten up, and break down the wall thereof, and it should be trodden down. Now that hedge is the protection. And it being trodden down, that's the most high having the nations come take us down and put and and bringing us into captivity. And I will lay it waste and it should be and it should not be prone, no dig, but there shall come up briars and thorns, that's the other nations, and I will also command the clouds that they rain no rain upon it now the clouds represents the prophets and the the rain is the word of the most high for the vineyard of the lord of hosts is the house of israel and the men of judah, judah is his present plant and he looked for judgment but behold oppression for righteousness behold a cry woe unto them that join house to house that they fail to fill to be no place that they may be placed alone in the midst of the earth. So yeah, our people have you know have become a degenerate. That's why the Mosai is only dealing with the elect and the elect alone. And the one that's going to only acknowledge the Mosai is the elect. Matter of fact, I close with Romans eleven. In verse 7 What then Israel Have not obtained that which he seeking for Now what is Israel seeking for The truth, salvation But they can't find it You know Like Israel Has a A, a toxic relationship With these different idols They're looking for love In all the wrong places so I read that again. What then Israel have not obtained that which, which he seek it for, but the election have obtained it and the rest were blinded. So the only ones that going to obtain this knowledge and obtain the faith of Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shah, is the elect. And that's the only one, only ones that's going to acknowledge the most high. Now it says, according as it is written, the Most High has given them the spirit of slumber, eyes that they should not see, and ears that they should not hear until this day. Um, so I close with that, and I I'm gonna say Kohalayim, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem Vakak Kodash. Until next time, Shalom.